together. The fuck do y'all expect? Hit the like, hit the like, hit the like. Whoever tuned in today, be sure. We finna unwrap this. Well, Cardi B was having a good day. She was doing the book signing. And it all started with her fans. It's always the fans. I'm trying to tell you. Y'all motherfuckers is just so so clingy, so attached, so nosy, like address but they did and look what they did they sent me a beautiful ass christmas gift and um this book costs money like this y'all y'all spent a good penny on this shit this shit cost like probably like four or five hundred dollars they took their time and they wrote me letters telling me how much they love me and it's a lot of pages but look at the quality of this book like i'm really blown away look at this this costs money. And um it's crazy. See that she was all happy. The book was nice. And then y'all gotta come in. I'm your biggest fan. But why does such and such? I was scrolling on your Instagram and I see that your offset was with bitch. Why does it matter? Why are y'all all up her ass like that? Like leave her alone. I don't think she's wrong in this. And I don't care who get get mad. I said what I said. Hate me. Unsubscribe to me. I don't care. I said what I said. She's not wrong for cussing y'all motherfuckers out. And saying what she said. Now when she went over the line. If y'all said that she said she tried to kill somebody. And she can get somebody killed or something like that. You shouldn't be talking to them like that. But y'all should not be pressing people buttons like that. Leave her alone. She already going through enough shit. No cap. Cause y'all don't shut the fuck up. And it's the same fucking dumb, my own fucking fan base. The last time I got dragged was cause my fucking fan base. I don't see nobody talking shit but my own fucking fan base. But y'all wanna send me a fucking book just to talk shit on the fucking timeline. Did I confirm I was with a man? No. So why the fuck y'all keep talking? Leave me the fuck alone. The fuck? Shut the fuck up. See, this is where you piss somebody off to the point of no return. She's sick of y'all ass. Y'all gonna hit her with the book just to butter her up and then still asking about her offset. And then one of you bitches brought up the kid. Like, y'all know that y'all don't do that. That's passing. She said what she said, and that's all I'm gonna fucking say. And if for those who's mad in the background that's sitting right there in the background saying, but we're fans. We're fans. Y'all don't do Krishan fans like that. Chris, I mean, sorry about that. Beyonce fans don't do her like that. If she was having a situation like that, Krishan fans wouldn't do her like that. If she was having a situation like that, she ain't even fucking. Who else? Lead a girl alone. If you're a fan, stick by her. Stay by her side. Y'all was supposed to make her books. That whole book signing thing go good. You know the Barty Gang. Shout out to the Barty Gang. I ain't disres- being disrespectful. But you hoes need to know. Stop disrespecting Cardi like that. Because y'all claim that y'all with her. But y'all got her fucked up out here. Like for real. Put some respect on her name. Like no cap. And for those in the back who are mad. And got a reason to say oh, I'm with it. Hit the hit hit the hit the hit the chat box to drop me drop comments, all that. What's up? I said what I said. And for the, all the bitches that's the man in the back, I'm gonna say it one more time. Listen to her out her mouth was she Firm anything? Shut the fuck up! About to delete my whole fucking social media, cause y'all don't shut the fuck up. And it's the same fucking dumb, my own fucking fan base. The last time I got dragged was cause my fucking fan base. I don't see nobody talking shit but my own fucking fan base. But y'all wanna send me a fucking book just to talk shit on the fucking timeline. Did I confirm I was with a man? No. So why the fuck y'all keep talking? Leave me the fuck alone. The fuck? Shut the fuck up. Cause I'm about to fucking unfollow all of y'all Cause that's all I see 
Y'all yeah, fucking shit on my timeline. I'm not I'm catching my name. I'm trying to see anybody else talking shit. Nobody is talking shit. But child, so shut the fuck up. All over my shit. Shut up. Y'all heard something out of my mouth? This y'all heard that I'm back with a nigga out of my mouth. No. Shit is fucking annoying. For fucking three days, y'all been doing the same shit. I, did I did I say I'm, did I say I, I was back together with somebody? Did I say that? Did y'all hear that? Did I say that he said it? No. No, Ken Barbie says to me, no, no, tell me to come down. I told you to tell him, leave me the fuck alone. Ken Barbie, shut the fuck up, because you one of the main ones. I ain't trying to hear none of that. And yeah, I said it. And to secondly, most of you motherfuckers that's coming at this girl is the same bitches that always take your niggas back. I don't care if you gay, straight, whatever. You always take motherfuckers back. Y'all be going back and forth. You bitches go back and forth so many times. It's a merry-go-round. So for y'all to come at her like that, y'all are all out of order. Y'all disrespectful as fuck. And she said what she said. I don't feel Cardi no wrong in this. I'm not going to look at Cardi no different way. Because Cardi is one of them artists that stands up to her fucking fans in my fucking book. Because they should have they should have watched their mouth and watched what they said when they came out of their mouth. And knew the situation that she was dealing with is you supposed to be a fan. And you know that everything that she dealing with and what she going with or going through right now. And you motherfuckers keep pushing, 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 pushing. When a motherfucker pop, don't be scared. Because that's what you got. I said what the fuck I said. Anyway, we're going to continue. People was talking about it. And yeah, the situation on whatever, how it all went and how everything broke down. Man, you bitches are, you bitches be having baby daddies that ain't shit. These niggas don't fuck four of y'all friends, two of your cousins, and you still take them back. I'm not trying to hear none of that shit. Y'all got y'all got Barty fucked up. Y'all got her fucked up right now. I'm trying to tell you. Anyway, we're gonna continue. Hit the like, hit the like, hit the like, subscribe. Mr. Matt. <laughs> now, why do y'all keep messing with this lady? Barty gang, why y'all be messing with this lady? Y'all know how Cardi get. Y'all know how she get. So if you guys remember, I don't know if y'all follow Cardi, if you're a part of the Barty gang, then you know that. Someone, a fan, had made Cardi a book and saw her a book earlier, you know, this month. There was a video of her, like, unboxing the book, but I can't find the video. I don't know if she deleted it or whatever happened. I don't know. But, honey, y'all don't made my girl go off today. She was going off. Did I say, did I say on my mouth I was back with somebody? Hmm? Did I say it on my motherfucking mouth? So why the fuck is y'all talking shit for? Why the fuck is y'all talking shit? Fuck out of here. Leave me the fuck alone. I didn't even say nothing. And allegedly, all of this is because the body gang has been putting pieces together thinking that she bad with Offset. And Cardi just feels like if it ain't come out of her mouth, then why the fuck y'all going around spreading that rumor? Granted, yes, we all know that it was her husband and allegedly they're supposed to be getting a divorce. I don't know where people got that they were back together just because he was around for Christmas. I mean, that is the father of her kids. Why would he not be around for Christmas? I guess people aren't used to, you know, people being adults and co-parenting, but, I mean, that do exist. And then I know someone posted a picture with Cardi and Offset while they were out shopping. Like, people have to understand, like, these, they're, they're celebrities, yes, but they are also married. So, if they decide to work out their relationship, they decide to work it out. But, obviously, they're not working it out from Cardi's mouth. Allegedly, there was a picture of, you know, her Offset and the fan, but I can't find that picture either. So, I guess the blog's deleted. Maybe she went off on their ass and they deleted it. But needless to say, this is why we need to start a people relationship and mind our own goddamn business. Let me humble sis a little bit right here. So if you don't know, I did it for you, girl. Cardi B went on, I think, Station Head, whatever, talking about her fans because there was a picture that she took with a fan and the lady was holding a dog. And then the fan also took a picture with Offset, the same place, holding the same dog. So you, of course, you know, the internet put two and two together and they made three. You know how that go. Then apparently they was out um, at a restaurant in New York City. This all happened in New York City because y'all know Cardi stay out in, I think, Jersey or the city, one of them. 
So if you've been living under a rock and you don't know that Offset and Cardi B allegedly broke up. Like, she's saying that she's single, can't really be single when you marry. But, okay, they're separated. They're separated. What really got me from this recording, and the thing is, I'm a Cardi B fan, but I'm not the fan that she talking about in this shit because I don't go hard for people I don't know. I don't go hard for celebrities. I don't go hard for that type of shit. I don't be on Twitter with all that extra shit. So she probably not even talking about you or me, but we still want to say she was just so we can do this video, okay? But what she was saying in here is that how she felt like her fans are against her because they was dragging her and blah, 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 and whoop, 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 and... Shut up. This is one of them messy bitches that I'm talking about right here. Blah, 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 whoop, 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 whoop. What's the blah, blah, whoop, whoop, whoop? Can you say it? It's because she tired of y'all motherfuckers. Y'all keep pushing people, but y'all all in people's business. Why ain't y'all in Will and Jada business? Will best friend just expose him. Why ain't y'all in a business? Go or uh, go over there. Go with somebody else. Go go over there. Shit, go to one of them deep houses or some shit. Go ask Cassie some more questions. Sub. Leave her the fuck alone. You bitches is bitter and mad. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. If you're a fan, then stand behind her. Stand by me. Face ass. Fuck you talking about. Anyway, I saw some shit that really pissed me off because y'all got Offset fucked up too now. Now, I know Offset did what he did, but still, y'all ain't got to treat the nigga like he ain't shit now. He's still a dad at the end of the day. And y'all really out here fucking clowning. And I mean all the Cardi fans. I don't even know if it's Cardi fans. It could be Cardi fans or it could be Nicki. Like, I don't know. But y'all really out here fucking clowning. Show what you got for yeah. Christmas. The daddy got to that. Like Bitch, how in the fuck was that her pushing some away that he gave her? She hugged it. You motherfuckers is messy and y'all can just start stuff for no reason. Y'all ain't got shit else to do. I don't know if it's the blog. I don't know if it's fair. I don't know who it is, but y'all need to leave that woman alone. Leave Cardi alone. Like I said before, just because you bitches got four, five baby daddies that don't want y'all hoes and that fucked on all y'all friends and keep coming back, y'all cannot come at her. Maybe you got a nigga in jail that's being pumped every fucking night you talk to him on the fucking phone. And you can't wait till the nigga get out. And when the nigga get out, he gonna fuck all your friends and be with the nigga that he's with. Goofy. Ha ha. Leave Cardi alone. Cause I, I, I swear I will do some exposing in this motherfucker. And you motherfuckers better get it together. You better get it together. Drop in the comments what y'all think. I might get a lot of unsubscribers after this video. But hey, at this point, I don't care. Cause you know I ain't lying about shit. I said, if you a fan, stick with her. If you not a fan, watch from the sidelines, bitch. Keep guessing. I'm not a fan of nothing, but I fuck with Cardi. That's all I'm say. So on this round, I'm team Cardi right now. I don't think she did shit wrong. I think she told people what she said. She said what she said. Leave her the fuck alone. Y'all all up under her ass. Leave her alone. Go smell somebody else's. She said what she said. And I'm going to leave it at that. You rocking with this channel? Be sure to hit the like, comment, subscribe. Comment your thoughts under this video as well. What you think? Because I'm sure I'm going to get a lot of them. Until the next one. Peace out.